the Tin Man. I got a really good back breaking one that uh, I think you'll enjoy. Check this out. Here you are once again at beautiful Heritage Park in Mission, British Columbia. And we have a tree right here in front that marks the front of the park. And it's weird, it's kind of all over the place, but it goes exactly with the theories that I've been teaching people. Check out all this scarring right here. I'm going to do a little bit of a zoom, get a little bit closer, follow that up. That one goes up to somewhere around there. This one here, was it on the other side? No, that one doesn't have one. This one has more scarring right there. I doubt it would be dinner. I thought there was a big scar on that one. I guess not. And then this one has a lot of scarring going up here. And then it's got the single slit scar. It's got another. I called it back breaking because it just looks like a backbone kind of. And, you know, they're breaking these girls to make them have these weird weird deformities what people are going to end up realizing is there was probably a break there at one time when the tree was a lot smaller of a structure a break there and another break there so when something starts growing off this way they break that and they do this and that anyway so they get a pretty good fine art into uh building these trees like this and you know when do our branches really ever do this on such a huge rate like naturally like you guys have to go into a natural sense here and think no the pruners are doing it or something else is doing it and our pruners haven't been shaping like this so people got to get into it and uh, yeah these scars help these scars are unusual we got to just start sharing that with uh, other tree people look at this one right here it's kind of neat and, and look at this one there it is right there. This one I found very interesting because this is so much a scarring or a bark pattern that we see on other trees. You got to admit, and I talk about maybe they've just done little slits, but eventually as the tree's swelling they become big slits. Look at here, you also see the secondary scar. So if one of them now came along once again and put another scar right there, you'd get another transition of a quick growing and fold over in a line like that. So those are things just to watch for along in this venture. Peace out from the Tin Man and the flowers are going crazy.